Hi guys, we're here in Claire Hobson's um, the aesthetic salon. She also does tattooing, and that's what we're here for today. And with Alyssa, say hi. hi. She's having a top up. Here's Claire, lovely Claire. Uh, I'm having my brows. I've had my brows done before, and I'm also having my lips done. And I'm a bit scared. So yeah, so you can see me squirming in the bed in a minute. <laughs> I'll be dead brave. I've had three, three babies at the exactly. end of the day. Yeah. Um, yeah, okay, so literally the first couple of minutes is going to hurt yeah. a little bit. Because you have to break skin. I have to break the skin and I need to get the line in. Once the line's in, then I'll get you numb and then it's going to be fine. Right. Promise. Okay, okay. Yeah. Because I have a bit of lip filler before. So, I mean, obviously that's good. Yeah, so lip Without any, any cream on. I don't think this is as bad as having lip filler. No. You know? No. And it's quick. It's like fucking two minutes for me to do the line. What is that? So what will you do? Will you like... I'm going to draw them on. Oh, you're going to... Yeah, I'm going to draw them Get on. all the shape perfect. Yeah. Yeah. Let's live life without regrets. Girl, put your faith in me, even though we just met. Let's forget about a curfew, because all that is stuck in my head. It's me and you. Both speed in my heart is racing, but I'm not sure I want to place it, because it only does this with you. Our bodies meet, I can feel the tension. We'll be sent to the next dimension. Let's just let everybody... How was the pain for the line? It was bearable. Yeah. Definitely. It was quite a bit um, sore the, on the top lip there, but that's like, bit, you know, Throwing your nerves. Yeah. Maybe sneeze a bit, but apart from that, oh god. <laughs> it's bearable. It's not like childbirth. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. You, I've been trying hard to keep my cool. On a scale of 1 to 10, how would you rate the pain, Leanne, for your eyebrows? Can't feel it. It's good. Can't feel it. It's all just the initial bit, isn't it? And same with the lips. Yeah. The lips got a little bit sore towards the end. But can't feel it at all, my eyebrows. No. Can't speak properly because I've got them. <laughs> like they're not attached to my body. <laughs> <laughs> This is me done straight after the treatment and yeah I know I do look a little bit scary um, a bit clowny but um, I'm gonna show you through each day and then it'll be really worth it in the end Thanks. <laughs> This is day one um, as you can see it's quite severe my lips are obviously very swollen and the pigment is obviously very pink um, it is weeping a little bit but it's understandable because it's obviously an open wound and it will begin to scab it's really hard obviously because I've had my lips done and my eyebrows I think if I had done one or the other it wouldn't be as bad but it is very clown like right now but it will be worth it um, it was stingy in the night, it was a little bit sore um, and it's starting to ease off and I can feel like the swelling going down a little bit now so uh, I'm hopefully they will go down again tomorrow and continue to do so and then just it's scabbing up and falling off but yeah I'm not really liking looking at myself right now I feel a bit embarrassed, I've got Hallie's friends here I'm like talking with my hand over my mouth 
but um, yeah, Claire assures me it will be worth it. Doesn't go with these pink nails either, does it? <laughs> Can't even laugh because it's hurting. I woke up like this. I woke up like this. Flawless. Not. But I will be. <laughs> I'll update you tomorrow and hopefully they'll be even smaller. So this is the end of day three. Um, this morning they were pretty bad. They were very swollen, very stingy and um, they've been pretty scabby today but they've actually calmed down a bit now. And as you can see there's uh, scabs aren't quite as bad. I've uh, had some Cephyrax on them and still been putting the Vaseline on but the light's not very good in here. But uh, yeah. I'm just thinking I'm looking a bit more normal, although maybe I'm just getting used to looking at myself, looking a bit clown-like. <laughs> yeah, they are so, but I can tell what they're going to look like, and um, they are getting better day by day. Where's his home tomorrow? He's going to take the mick out of me, big time. So, um, what else girls do? Hi guys, okay, so this is day and as you can see my lips are very very scabby uh, yesterday was very sore stingy uh, but now I'm through the worst of it um, my eyebrows are still pretty dark but I can feel them going like a bit harder a bit crispier my lips have got a lot of um, cream on as you can see they are pretty scabby but hopefully in the next day or two you'll see the results and oh, all will be well. Can't even smile literally. <laughs> I keep saying to people don't make me laugh. They're still a bit swollen. Um yeah. So that's where I'm at. So here I am. It has been ten days. Um I know I vlogged the first few days after I had the um tattooing done and I got really scabby I mean the, the scabs were they, they didn't get any worse than what you've seen on the last one so it was just a case of them healing um, each day and I did get some really good tablets actually um, I got a prescription for them and they're called I'm not sure how to pronounce it if anybody wants this treatment done and they've ever had a cold sore in their life ever I advise you to get them tablets and take them a week before um, because that's obviously I must have had a cold sore at some point in my life because I didn't think I had and that's why I didn't take them and that's what she asked me for Claire asked me that to make sure but I was like yeah just go ahead I don't think so in hindsight now I wish I just took them because obviously having cold sores in your lips is not nice um, I had a big event to go to on Saturday which wasn't great but um, we got over it. By Saturday they would like I could put lipstick on like a, a coloured lip balm which you can get now as well so anybody that does have it done or um, does some of the cold sores that's something to know. I got it from Laura, Laura Mercier and um, they do all different colours, lip balms and I just got like a purpley one so it went over my lips. Um, yeah. Though it was difficult in the process, I literally didn't go out for a week because I had sores all over my mouth. But she did say it's like five to six days downtime if, if you heal normally. The percentage is only 5% of people that um, have a breakout like I did, and I had a pretty bad one. So that's just typical of my look. But uh, um, yeah, so they're healing nicely. They are actually looking really nice. It's still quite pink and I think the colour will go down a little bit more than what it is. But if you can see, they've still got a couple of little sores on there. But they're healing nicely and my eyebrows look gorgeous. Really nice shape. I am overall really pleased. 